everyone, today we are going to talk about MOSFET safety precautions. But first, let's get a basic understanding of what a MOSFET is. MOSFET is also known as insulated gate field transistor, which consists of a thin layer of a silicon oxide between both the gate and the channel. As you can see the illustration above, MOSFETs are very delicate devices and can be easily destroyed. Because MOSFETs are such delicate devices, the first thing we should do is take precautions. So what is the reason MOSFETs have to be handled very carefully? First, they should never be connected or disconnected while the power is on. It could damage the device. Next is, before picking up a MOSFET device, get your body grounded by touching the chases of the equipment you are working on to avoid yourself getting electrical shock. For number two, manufacturers have, have a specification sheet that a voltage source can only limit to a 20 voltage, which means if this exceeds to a limit of 40 or 45 volts, this can ruin a MOSFET. A MOSFET is basically they have high input resistance and gain flowing through the channel and then if it's not properly or handled carefully it will ruin or damage the over damage it and it will cause over voltage or too high current number three what methods are used to protect the MOSFETs during shipping to avoid the damage to the device MOSFETs are usually shipped with the leads shorted together. Shorting techniques include wrapping leads with the short wires, inserting the device in the shorting rings, and etc. Newer MOSFETs are protected with xenodioids, electrically connected between gate and source internally. The dioids protects against static discharge and in-circuit transients and eliminate needs for external sorting device. Generally, ground rings are used to short all leads of MOSFET for avoiding any voltage buildup between the gate and source. The grounding and shorting rings are removed after the MOSFET is connected to the circuit. Last but not least, these are the following procedures on how to handle safely the unprotected MOSFET. 1. Prior to installation into a circuit, this should be kept shortened together. Number 2. The hand used to handle the device should be grounded with a metallic wristband. The soldering iron tip should be grounded. And number 4 is that a MOSFET should never be inserted or removed from its circuits when the power is on. Thank you.